Hello everyone, um, I'm in my new ant shed. Um, over the course of um, a few months, I've had a ant shed been built, and I now have my own facility for ants. Um, so to celebrate, I thought I'd show you a Solenopsis Gemini colony, which I'm going to put into a test tube. And um, keep um, here she is, the queen, stunning queen, absolutely stunning, amazing color. Anyway, uh, the ant shed which I have right now is, I have um, all of my colonies here and my equipment and outside is outside. Um, it's uh, here I have a bunch of colonies. I have a colony up there with a thermostat as well. That's where I keep my leaf cutters. There. Um, which they've managed to make a new garden. Which is nice. Um, here you can see that they've made a new garden. And they're now storing bread there. Which is good. So that new garden, I'll zoom in. Amazing, there's the old garden, the old fungus. Which is still healthy, there's the other one as well. Um, overall very healthy colony. Um, if I can get the hammer out of the way, I've been doing some work with it. Um, temperature is, you would already said it. The temperature is 24.5, what should be. Yeah, 24.5 is what it would be. There's the Redomermix Pignelli. Uh, there is a heater, which I use. I've got total control of the temperature, so it never goes past a certain degree. I have my own chair as well. That's where my incubator is. That's where the food is. That's where the cockroaches are as well, where I breed cockroaches and mealworms and whatnot. And there's where the bulk of the colonies are. There. That's where the bulk of them live. In there. I've also got some Fidoli Pallidola, which I'm currently looking at at the moment. And this SJ Banana colony, which I'm inspecting. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you all later. Bye-bye for now.